Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and um, I know I'm looking crazy today, so please just, you can't really ignore it. You've seen by the title of this video that I'm going to be going to um, an event today and I wanted to take you guys along with me. And so I'm just doing my, you know, my little routine to get ready for my event. If you're new to my channel, make sure that you hit the subscribe button. This video is, you know, it's vlog style, so it's not going to be... It's probably going to be all over the place because to be honest with you, I'm not that used to vlogging yet, but I'm, you know, I'm trying. You see that I'm trying. So anyway, I'm getting ready for this event that I'm going to. I wanted to try and like do, show you all, you guys all of um, the getting ready process, but time ran away with me and now I've literally got an hour to get out of the house. So I've come out of the shower, done my skincare routine. I've got some eye patches on. Let me show you which ones. Okay, so the eye patches that I'm wearing are these um, Garnier Moisture Bomb Eye Sheet Masks. And um, I got two of them. They were quite cheap. They're actually on sale in Boots. Um, you can put them in the fridge. They're basically just to brighten your under eyes, get rid of any bags or dark circles, or anything like that. Um, they have hyaluronic acid and orange juice, so it's just going to brighten up your skin. So definitely if you're going to like an event or you've got a special occasion or something, then obviously an eye mask or something like that is really good. And there's loads of them, but the ones that I could find in a hurry was this brand. Okay, so um, that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to leave this on for another five minutes or so. It's already been on for about five minutes. So I'm going to be showing you, I probably won't show you my makeup routine. I'll do that at some other point. I just don't have the time that I have to rush. Um, I've got some new eyelashes actually. I've got these eyelashes. I buy eyelashes all the time. Do you guys do that? I'm not even looking at the camera. I'm so sorry, guys. I buy eyelashes all the time because when I go on a night out, I take them off and I throw them somewhere because, you know, usually you're, you know, you're kind of tired after a night out. But I need to really start holding on to my eyelashes. Um, yeah, so about to get ready. I'll show you guys my outfit, definitely. And then you can come with me to the event. So, let's do it. Okay, guys. So, it's probably literally been about an hour, probably to the minute since um, the last clip. And so I'm now ready. I've got my my hair. I've got my my blonde. I actually cut this bob myself, which I'm so excited about. Like, I mean, it's not perfect, but it's it's doing what it needs to do. This is, if you probably remember one of my other videos, um, I'll link it in the cards because it is a synthetic wig that I cut um, into a bob. So it was really long and um, it was starting to get a little bit raggedy on the end. So I decided that I would um, cut it, my baby in the corner, um, into a bob, kind of like an asymmetric bob. And I really, really like it. So anyway, I haven't got my clothes on yet. So I'm going to go into the bedroom. I'm going to show you what I'm wearing. Like I said, it's about five to five-ish. The event starts at six and it's going to take me about an hour to drive there. So I don't need to be like the first person to open the door, but I don't want to be late today because anybody that knows me knows that I am always late. So I'm trying to be good today. Um, try and show up, you know, in the right manner. Um, do you like my makeup? Very simple, just flawless face. I love this ombre lip. Um, the combination is a sleek pencil, MAC um, Velvet Teddy. Um, I'll have to put down the, the colour of the sleep um, lip pencil if you would like it. Um, my arm is hurting me. Oh, how do you vloggers do it? Um, yeah, so it's just, I didn't do really that much in terms of my like eye makeup, a little bit of gold in the corners and my eyelashes. So I feel cute, put together and let's go see what I'm going to wear. Okay, guys, so here we are. This is like, this is my clothes just laid out on my bed. Um... So this top, I'm, this is the top that I was thinking about wearing, okay, and it will make sense when I show you my blazer, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, I thought about wearing this because my blazer's brown. I have my Telfar bag, which I love. This is the second Telfar bag that I have, and I absolutely love it. I've got my shoes. I haven't worn these before, so in case you're wondering why I've got them on the bed, they are brand spanking new. Um, they're from ASOS, um, healed um, what they called, you know, these like heel dong sandals. Um, my perfume that I'm wearing today is my new favorite and it's the Libre, Libre, 
Libra, Libre, um, from YSL, so I'm wearing that today, and here's my jeans, these pretty little thing, um, cut jeans, they're quite open, there's another top here as well that I was thinking about wearing as well, which is a bodysuit, one of those high-legged bodysuits, so I'm not really sure, I think this one goes better with my blazer and the gold and the brown, it just keeps in the right theme, um, so yeah, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go with this top here, and my blazer, let me show you, Okay, so here is the blazer, massive bow, bow on it, um, it's here, I'm going to cut that bit of string off, it's just, I don't know, um, yeah, so this is the brown blazer, anyway, I think I just need to put everything on, and once I am put together, I will show you the final look. Okay, so this is not the best light, but I want you guys to just see the outfit, so here we have the blazer with the top, I've got my little blue bra on, I thought... Um, I have to wear a bra, so at least a coloured bra that goes with what I'm wearing. So if it's shown, I don't really mind. Um, my little brown belt, these mum, I think they're mum style jeans. Um, and my good to go, really comfortable um, flip flop heels. So this is the entire look. Let me get my bag, one minute. Okay, so here is the bag to go along with the look. I feel super cute, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I feel so cute in this. And look at my nails. Wait, let me show you guys. My nails. Yes. Everything matching. When we do this, we do this properly. <laughs> so anyway, like I said, I'm running late. Um, I'm gonna go, just make sure I've got everything in my bag, ID, uh, cards, phone and you know what this telfar bag i know a lot of people thought you know it would think that it's really small it is so like compact and i can get everything that i need in it including this new phone i can get it all in the bag so anyway i'm good to go i'll catch you at the event see you later okay guys so i'm in the car getting ready to go and um, i'm a little bit behind like my schedule but it's okay it's okay so um I wanted to like take you on the drive with me, but I haven't got a proper attachment for the phone, et cetera, et cetera. I'm gonna sort all of that, those things out so that you can definitely come on the drive with me. But obviously it's also annoying that I wanna play my music. I wanna get lit and turn up before I get there. So um, obviously with YouTube, you can't really play um, music because you'll be quite copywritten. So a lot of the event, if they're playing music, I'm probably gonna have to put music over it or something. So ugh, we'll see how it goes. And it's a YouTube event, and, and this is what they're doing. But anyway, I'm going to get going, because like I said, it's probably going to take a while. It's 5 o'clock. That is key prime traffic time. So, yeah. Leg out. Let me level with you. Let me be in your crew. I just want to be free. Be with people like me. I'm so not in the mood to be broken and blue. I just want to go dance. Baby, find me some I don't wanna waste another night. Hi. Are you coming for me? Yeah, I am. Yeah, I do. I just wanna hit the floor. Maybe somewhere I haven't been before. I don't wanna kill the vibe. I don't wanna feel it if I don't feel right. I just wanna break the ice. Than your average, and that is TTYA. If you guys don't know already on the stage, and we have our amazing Patricia Bright. So let's give him a round of applause. So I worked with Google, I had my own collaborations, I've had my own clothing lines, I have I've done so many projects to the point that I actually can't <laughs> crack quite <laughs> count. Um, but I've worked with so many amazing people and have been able to build such a great platform. So I'm really like proud of the network and the community that I'm mm -hmm. clear on your terms when you work with management. So I want to do TV, I want to do Dancing with the Stars, I want my own show, I want a shoe collection. How are you going to make this happen for me? Is then will help you come to management to really help you achieve that next average. Irene, mean, what would you what was your experience with management and having a team around you and you know getting you to where you feel right now, like maybe probably your best. How how was your process for that? 
Um, I was quite independent a lot at the beginning. Um, I think because of these days you can't even cough, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But um, at the beginning, I was very, very independent, um, and because a lot of stuff was just coming to me directly. And, and but I also, I feel like you have to know when it's time to say, you know what, this isn't working for me. Um, but, but again, similar to what Patricia said, you can't expect the management to just base. You can't just be like, oh, guys, tomorrow I want to have lunch with Barack Obama, and expect it to just happen. Like I think there's steps to there's steps to to your professional career and understanding that you are the conductor of the bus mm -hmm. and that your agency are gonna feed into whatever you've got going on and you also have to have a clear strategy of where you want to go. One of a kind, one of the better boys I'm on your level, that's what you say But all I hear is noise I don't have time for trying my luck I've been too hurt before You're not that special, just give it up I think I've had enough I'm too busy loving my friends I ain't got no love to spare for you I'ma be that girl to the end It don't really matter you do, guess I have to tell you again, cause you haven't got the news, but you really need to understand, that I don't wanna be your going back to the car park now and these shoes oh my word can you see them hold on these shoes are gorgeous but they are killing my feet um it was a really good event i met some really good people um hopefully we can do some collaborations and stuff just in the car park the only thing that upset me to the core is that there was goodie bags there were goodie bags and um me partying you know the party animal that i am um left it so late that all the goodie bags were gone and I'm so pissed off. There were so many really good things in the good goodie bags. Well, I'm telling you, microphones, um, stream cameras, candles, everything. So anyway, I'm gonna talk to YouTube because I'm gonna need me one of those goodie bags. Yeah, this is really the end of the night. I'm in the car park, Shepherd, uh, Westfield, the West London one, and I'm about to get in my vehicle and I'm about to drive home. So. Um, I think I may end the vlog here. Let me see. Yeah, I may end the vlog here and I think I'm going to pick up another vlog later in the week. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope I got enough footage to go around. Um, but yeah, I really, really, really enjoyed this event. Um, it was amazing. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and um, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>